Hey y'all, welcome back to my channel. So today I'm going to be doing a flexi rod set because I had a um a TikTok that blew up. It had half a million views. I don't even know that counts as blowing up because TikToks be having a gazillion million views. But anyways, I had a TikTok that had half a million views of me just taking down my flexi rods and everybody's asking for a tutorial even though I have like a couple up. But you know that how YouTube is. They want they want it a, a new one. It, they don't care if you made it before. Did a new one. And it's okay because if y'all watch it who cares so i forgot to film the intro before i did it so yeah let's get into the video okay. all right i'm gonna cook you though why do i keep wearing white in these videos okay let me finish put this on first cuz uh uh but okay so is this a new video angle from my room that I've never used before and really I just sat down because I wanted to sit down and I didn't want blue all over my bed cuz the blue gets everywhere so if y'all could see how I have this set up this is so ghetto but Hopefully, it don't keep falling over and over again because I, I don't have the time nor the patience. Wait, what the fuck is on my wall up there? Why have I never noticed that? Anyways, oh, and I have this big pimple. It's not there yet, but it's coming. And it looks like a mosquito bite right now, but it doesn't itch or nothing i haven't been outside so i'm pretty sure it's just a pimple that's about to come up y'all know how i be I, I always look a mess after i wash my hair um yeah my hair is freshly washed in deep condition oh this light makes this blue look really pretty first i want to say i do not know what size these are i got these from the beauty supply store a minute ago yeah these are orange i'm trying to like compare it to like you know other stuff so you can get a gist of how big they are but you're only gonna need eight swear swear you're only gonna see eight in my hair at the end of this video and i like to use this people ask me what i use to have them fluffy but still hold enough for like at least a week and i always tell people a lot of body and they're like a lot of body makes your hair crunch and i'm like no not the not the lot of body that looks like this gatorade curl and style milk Moisturize me, curling style milk, a lot of body. You know, it's like it's a cream. Not me tapping like this is as much. Yeah, and I'm gonna put in some leave-in conditioner because my hair is just like really dry because it's colored. <laughs> I don't know why, but colored seems sounds so great. Anyways, can see that's why I don't like filming up close like this because like the focus annoys me. Yeah, so you need a flexi rod, something to tangle your hair, something to part if you part. I usually use my fingers, but I like to keep the one in the front clean because that's usually part that I use like once I take it down. And then leave in conditioner if your hair is like really, really dry because this does moisturize it. But if you plan on keeping it in like a week or more, you might want like a little bit extra moisture. But I would say it takes longer to dry. But the way that I do my flexi rod sets and the way that like my hair is cut right now is kind of short. So to give to like make it look more lengthy, I don't let it dry all the way because then it's going to like, you know, be tight curls because you wrap it around here. But if you take it down before it's completely dry but it's still set in the pattern and you diffuse it it hangs a little more it kind of looks like second day hair if you get what i'm saying but yeah i got my mirror right here and that is not the middle whoa see try to do stuff on the camera without a mirror back to what's at hand this isn't gonna stay oh it just might section your hair in fours i do by the middle and then by the ear if you see that it was kind of even yes 
if i wait until my hair is like completely dry the next day like if i just give up and don't feel like doing anything i'll spray my hair a little just a little get it a little damp i don't want to put a lot of leave-in conditioner oh i just smacked some leave-in conditioner now we're gonna take this section split it in two i like to do it in the middle the two sections going straight across and then you just feel to make sure they're even because if you try to get them each section as even as possible because if it's not then your curls are going to be all out of whack and you can do that like if you want but i like mine to be a little more uniform yeah that's about right so we're gonna move this top piece out the way now we're taking the lot of body i usually do three squirts on each piece but since I cut my hair, that might be why my hair has been taking so long to dry. Because I shouldn't be putting three pieces because my hair, I don't have as much. But I've, I've still been putting the same amount. These two products do not smell good together. But I will say this line doesn't smell good on its own. <laughs> so <laughs> it might be that. Okay. So you're going to put your flexi rod in half like this, like a horseshoe. And then you're gonna split the section that you just moisturized and take one of the half sections and see I go put the oh, put the hair under, come above it, and I'm still gripping onto this, and I'm twisting this. Like see how my wrist I'm twisting this as I'm going. So it's almost like a I don't, I don't want to say a bantu knot because that's not what it is. Almost like a bantu knot across this. And then you fold it where you stop it. And then you do that on the other side. And twist. You see how I'm twisting my wrist? You see that? Yes. And then I kind of like push them together. Sometimes I forget that I already put leave-in conditioner and I end up putting more. Ow. Okay, so I'm just going to do two two squirts. Maybe like a quarter size amount. A quarter size in natural hair terms. And then, you know, same thing. Split that section. Take the first piece. Twist, wrap. faces I'll be making when I do this got me self-conscious that first piece was kind of thick wait am I redoing it no okay I'm not showing y'all all eight but I will show you the last two it's probably gonna be in the front in this section I'm gonna do this one next and I do this one and then I do this one so I'm gonna listen to some music while I finish this I'll be back in like 10 minutes so i didn't go listen to music i started watching um my hero academia vines and i almost forgot about this video <laughs> that video was like 11 minutes long and i was only nine minutes into it so i did this pretty fast oh look a stray piece of hair whatever will i do cut it don't tempt me. Do not tempt me. Where the fuck does this go? It's literally in the middle. I don't have the time. Nor the patience. Mm -mm. I'm unraveling one, by the way. I'm trying to stick it in the mirror. And I'm going to cut it. I've done that too much. Bro, stuff always happens to me, bro. I can't never just have a good day. Like, what did I do to deserve that straight piece of hair? I should have cut it. Since you want to be doing all that. My hands been on hair too long. I, I can't tell if this is even or not. Well. I 
I feel as though it's not, but I really cannot tell. You know what? I don't I don't have time to think logically. Yes, I just pulled a hair because it was in the way. Um I'm getting I'm getting restless. This is why this is the only hairstyle I do because it's literally the fastest one to do, literally 15 minutes. And I just and I still don't be having the patience. I still be sometimes going to sleep with only two or three sections done. Yeah, this section is way too big. These pieces are thick. Cause she thick. Thick. Yeah, that's why those ends felt like that. Thick section. I need to stop cursing these videos because <laughs> who about to edit all of this? Not me. Who also doesn't want to get demonetized? Me. I really like this angle though. I think I'll do more videos in this angle. I think that's why I haven't really been doing like get ready with me videos because I just didn't have like I felt like I didn't have no nice areas to do them in with this little like you sitting at my desk. I don't know why I never thought of this. Like I'm pretty sure I brought the desk to do YouTube videos on it. The cut is so blunt in the front. The ends always do that and it annoys me a lot. Um, I'm done. I'm wiping my hands on this towel so y'all don't think I'm eating cookie dough with hair product cans. Mmm. Which I might be. But, I'll be back tomorrow to, um, take this down. And, um, film an intro. Because I didn't film an intro. Gatorade right after cookie dough is not good. <laughs> Gatorade is so salty. Why did I just... I just woke up. But I'm going to take my hair down. As you can see, this one came loose in my sleep. So I'm not looking forward to how that one looks. But you just get it straight like that and just unravel them down. short they are <laughs> okay then i just unravel them so it'll be easier to separate them because if you don't unravel them they're like not up at the ends If it's not dry all the way, you probably don't want to unravel them. You probably just want to go straight in with the diffuser while they're still like all bundled up. This one's already about to separate. It's easier if you stretch them when you separate. This is the first time I did a fully dry flexi bra set on this cut. And usually I don't like fully dry sets because they shrink so much. But I'll probably stretch it out with wearing a pineapple for a whole day because I don't have any plans for today. So I'm probably gonna stay in my room with it in the pineapple. I don't know why my face is so serious while I'm doing my hair. Oh, oh. I could probably fluff this up into a big fro. Fluffing a little bit with my hands cause I don't have a pick. So I'm going in and pulling out but not 
far enough to disturb the curls. It's really fluffy, but as you can see, it's really defined also. And I don't know if like, it's just so shiny. My hair must really like that um, treatment that I gave it, but I will be doing a, a wash day routine. So y'all can get these shiny, shiny curls like this. Wow, I have not seen my hair with this much shine in a little minute. And it's not like an oily, cause it's not oily at all, but it's just, it just looks healthy. I have big pimple in my face. But don't forget to like, comment, subscribe, and I'll see y'all in my next video.